push push up on the pins. So the pins are too Yeah. Um, way flat. Good question. They probably have one on the. Close it. I have to load my ghost round. Yep. So I'm putting it on fire. Uh, save first. Then charge. Yep. Pull both charging handles back. Put it forward. I was 1-4. When? 2015, 2015. Yeah. Which company? But there's only one way because you're rigid in. It. it makes sure it's flush against the metal. Right metal on metal. Sometimes a little gap, the gas tube won't seat correctly. To, to place it on safe. These are the holes you were talking about? Yeah, so this hole and this uh, temple right there. system and put it up like this. Okay, hold it. And then take your right hand, left hand, whatever's stronger, and you're gonna pull up and twist on that like that. Okay? So this is its own piece. You take this off. Yep. Pull it off and then set it down. That's its own piece and that's the best I can. Use your imagination and hopefully next week we can get some uh, actual fuses for you guys because as a training aid this kind of falls short but with those spoon spins and safeties it becomes much more clear what you need to do. But here we go. All right. So he's down there. His gun's down. The first thing he is going to do is stand up just enough. So step one is he's going to peek, identify the target, come back behind cover. He's going to reach into his kit, secure that first hand grenade. He is going to sweep the safety. He is going to loop the pin, pull. Grenade is prepped. He will peek one more time, throw the hand grenade, get back behind cover, and immediately put that second hand grenade in the...